Hello everyone, welcome back to my uh, latest video, Virtual Pool 4. It's been a few days, sorry about that, it's pretty busy. Going to be a bit hit and miss until probably after May the 7th and then things will settle down a little bit. However, you'll notice on here I have some career modes, uh, Carb Monster. I think that was when I was feeling a bit down about my weight, so I decided, um, you know, Carb Monster. The good news is that the dog bite's getting better. Um, as I can see, it's starting to heal up quite nicely. Um, wasn't very nice. If anybody wants to see a picture, I can put one up. Um, I've started three new career modes, as you can see, and, and I'm in the middle of qualifying. The reason for that was, is on the snooker season, I changed the career mode to a money list. Um, but then I also realized that I hadn't really adjusted the frame targets for, for any of the events. So I went back through, changed it all, used the nine ball career money uh, ranking points, which were a bit more you know, up and down in terms of <clears throat> the shootout, in terms of, you know, double chance, things like that. So makes it more fun, making the kind of room knockouts uh, less of an issue. And obviously there's the bar table thing, which is great for nine ball, not so great for obviously uh, eight ball and black ball. So there's little compromises to make. However, today you'll notice that we are, there's 32 spots for, 32 players for two spots. And we're down to the final four in each of the career modes. So today's going to be a, a career mode qualification video and we're going to start with 10 balls so a little bit different so so again being that it's a race to two does obviously open us up to the chance that unfortunately we might um what's the word we we, we may completely fail um in terms of of qualifying um so you've got to, i've got to, got to obviously play quite well and have one eye on safety and not do things like that uh, which will see us get beat pretty pretty soundly off off computers. What we don't want to see is the computer uh, making lots of, of excellent clearances because that will put the pressure on. And ideally, we want to qualify. You know, this looks a bit dodgy. Hey, oh, damn it! We really need Vidal to miss <laughs> soon. Not so soon. Vidal so soon. Okay. He missed. That's what we need. Getting off. That's good stuff. So ideally, we just want the computer to roll over and play dead for us um, so we can get qualified. And once we're qualified, I dare say we're probably not going to get, um, you know, we're probably not going to lose from there. Now, with 10 ball, the note, the rule, the note, it is non-slop on the money ball. Not that I do that great deal, but, you know, if you miss, it always helps to go to another pocket. Um... Ten ball rack, I haven't even thought about ten. Oh, I thought that was in. Now that could be in the three, go on three. And no. Bit of an ugly, oh dear. Nine balls just really just uglied up this rack. Um, yeah, so we'll play it with a toucher side here. Just to get right tight behind that two ball. I dare say, well that's a good shot. And and that's 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 irritating. And so is that. That's a not a great shot. So we've got half a chance here. That looks wide, but it's the speed will help him. Damn. Oh, come off it. Damn it. That's in. So he's going to win this one. Pack him here. No golden break. Oh dear. Right, so six is minging. And he's pushed into a potable position. Uh, the th four is disgusting. So, I don't like this at all. What I might do here is just roll in this five. Hopefully I haven't edged myself. Stop the white dead. Play this up the cushion and try and open the six. Oh, didn't get it. Didn't get it. And Houston, we now have quite a big problem. Now, mm, that worked. That's a hell of a shot. Wow. Wow. I mean, that's that's just a match win, isn't it? Uh, 
I'm on two consecutive fouls. I need a good shot here. Big shot here on the seven. I'm not going to foul so it can go away. Yes. Right, so number one in the bag. Didn't deserve it. Didn't deserve it, but I'm through. And that means I have qualified, guys. So whatever happens with Jesse the Bod, I'm through. So we're going to move to 8-Ball World now. Playing the banker. And again, I'm in the final four. Just trying to get qualified. And now it's a two-game race against Jesse the Bod, who... I don't particularly know as a brilliant player at uh, this game. It looks like stripeys are the chance here. Give back, go get over there. Now this game is what I think is the Rolls Royce of pool. You just have to, you know, you just have to do well. That hasn't got the legs, you idiot. You damn fool. for the skill shot oh now that's actually made life worse for Jesse the board so I should be able to clear up now uh, not a bad shot really uh, make forces me to think hmm now I'm gonna afford to pot this ball over the bag, I'm just going to roll into a full ball, it will turn in, and then use the angle of this ball to leave an angle on this the orange. Not a great effort, that to be honest. Upset with that shot, that's piss poor, especially with this like that. So I'm going to have to throw it in. Got it. Just so we now have the break, so it'd be nice if we brought and dished this. We do get a ball in now. We're just looking for a good split. Have we got one? Uh, looks like stripes on the ball, but the purple's a bit of a meh, otherwise, everything else is looking good. So, we're just gonna get rid of that horrible ball. We've messed up the f f 11. That's a really poor effort. Definitely didn't want to do that. So we're just going to use the 15 to top spin up for it. Almost missed that ball. That wasn't the best shot either. So um, half a pocket here. And we do need to send the ball careering. So. Ah, dear, dear, dear. Now, the, obviously, the shot that we have in our favor is the two ball which is very, very difficult to get. Now, you might try and go after it here. He's played a very, very good shot here. And very, very commendably played the black out. So that looks like good. Now, this is the crunching shot. And it went in. So it looks like we're going to be one game all. So that was a bit frustrating. So we now need to really just send you in here to try and think how we're going to clear the balls. And if we look, we see that the... Uh, the spots are particularly nice. Uh, no easy peasy opener, but we can get the orange. Don't want to miss this one, so we've just got to concentrate now. That one's in, and we're going to be in a nice spot for probably the seven here. Get the seven. Roll the one in. dead straight that could have been better I'm thinking now roll in the I'm going to be fancy here deliberately leave a plant to get rid of these two balls and then come out for the two I'm 
going to go behind the eight ball here. I need that to spring out. Go on, spring out, you swine. Oh, am I there? I'm not there. Oh, dear. Right. That feels like it goes. But it's a massive shot. Yes. Got it. Right, so we're through to that one as well. So the last one is the black ball. So if we can get a win here, then we are on the whites away. So hopefully you'll just re-break that. I mean, to be honest, the reds are looking pretty tasty. But he re-breaks it. Snooze Hughes. Was a pretty good player back in the day, Snooze Hughes, when he used to play, Gareth. Must be a good VP4 player. Don't know if he still plays. I haven't seen him around for years. But I hope he's doing well. Now this is all getting <clears throat> it's all getting a bit untidy now. And he's played safe, so given that he's got problem balls, I'm gonna just open mine up and I've actually played I've got a bit lucky there and I've played his red safe. And he's gone in off, so not sure what I'd do here. I think I'd probably just knock his red safe in the first instance. That's fine, I'll live with that. And then what I'm gonna do here is open up all of my balls. And his balls are in trouble. So that's quite a clever shot, makes it just a bit harder for me. So what I'm gonna do is just play patient. And I'm calling the black here, and he's missed completely. Uh, so I'll have that in bulk. We do have a free shot. I'm not sure I can really use the free shot, really. Oh, I pressed in place, didn't I? Never mind. I'll just take this one off the table. And begin to clear up the rest of the balls. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave that over the middle bag. And I'm on about that one there. That one. Because when I do this shot, I'm going to leave myself a plant. Now if something was to go wrong with this, and I have gone too short, then... I can use the fact that I've got this other ball. Now I'm going to try. No, I'm not. Mm. Now here we've got the land. It's all about speed control of the shot. On the back cushion, I'm going to wait. I think it's short. No, it's fine. <laughs> so one f one rack away from being qualified for the tours, and the last one I need to do is a snooker tour. So I haven't forgotten. Now, to me, that yellow's the easy starter, but it's slightly more tricky. But we can get straight into the tricky bit by just doing that. And in four, it's gone a bit wrong, but we can just. Now, noting we have a, f a ball. Oh, we didn't want to do that, but we've put his ball safe. So it's very, very difficult for Snooze Hughes to clear up here. Because he's got the ball up there, the snackered, and he's got another one. We'll need that to drop. Um, now, given that he has a free shot, but he has two busted balls. It's hard for him to open both up. Now he's opened up. And as you can see, it's very difficult for him to do it. So he's still in trouble. Um, I can just open up my bad ball. 
that I'm going to cut and then start to think about I'm trying to be a bit fancy I'm not that safe well I wanted to leave that um, so here let's put this one go up over it try and leave that ball at the top might be narrow that actually but anyway we're going to back ourselves we're going to back ourselves to clear up where we were <laughs> Oh dear. This is bad. That was not good. Everything was going well there. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, we'll have that. <laughs> right. So I messed the rack up, but um, get to anyway. So yeah, all three uh, qualified guys. That's great news. We can get on with some more videos. So let me know which videos you want. And I'll see you guys in the next video. I will get a snooker one up soon. And we'll see you guys. Uh, once I've got the players sorted, I'm going to have another go at that. So watch this space. Take care, guys. See you soon. Bye for now.